Well, hello there, everybody. Dre here, and welcome back to the grim existence of a Border Patrol officer in Contraband Police. Today's gonna be a good day. Hopefully better. Shut up, man. I'm introducing the video. Hopefully better than the first episode, because I kind of accidentally killed, like, two people and almost died myself. But, uh, honestly, I won't be bat mad if I get shot again. That just makes this more fun. What is this? Oh, newspaper. Fake help. Arm smuggling stopped. All thanks to me, I'm assuming. I don't have time to read that because this guy's already yelling at me to work. Anyways, what do we got going on today? We got three smugglers. All right, so age of 54, license plate number 96IU, and vehicle color purple. That's, I mean, I guess purple vehicles are rare, so that could be something to look out for. Also, the kingdom of Urukai has criminal groups. The government has imposed an embargo on all goods in the country, so anything from Urukai we cannot take. And then we have the cargo list, which we saw in the last episode. So purple, age 54, 96IU, and no goods from Urukai. Why is this thing leaning so sideways? Dude, you, you, you have a freaking flat. You also got ch <laughs> chickens. What's up, guys? You having fun back there? Oh, that is great. Definitely, there's going to be drugs under those chickens, I'm calling it. Why is everyone so creepy in this game? All right, so he's 37, so we don't have to worry about that. Um, he's got chickens, apple crates, and hay bales. I mean, I did see that, but we will check the cargo to make sure. Everything else, I believe, looks good here. So, yeah, let's check this cargo out and make sure everything is good. What's up, little chickens? I'm just going to unpack you. All right, so I believe we he actually is being honest. Also, I do want to use the UEV on anything that can be hidden. I mean, could it be in a chicken? Do I have to open up a chicken if there's a snake symbol on it? Oh, that would be freaking horrifying. Everything's looking pretty good here. 13, 2, and 3. Yeah, this guy is honest. I think he's good. Hopefully, I don't screw this up. All right, send it back, buddy. The one thing I am worried about, I don't think... I think later on in this game, you do have to worry about damaged parts. On cars, they might have taken that out of this game as well. Um, I'm pretty sure it was this game that made you ding them for damaged parts. But yeah, right now, all I have on my inspection report is name, exp expiration, password number, photo, cargo list. You can see it goes all the way to at 10, though. So there is things that are going to slowly unlock as the game gets more complex. Anyways, I'm wasting too much time. We're going to approve you. Hopefully, I didn't miss anything. And look at that. A good citizen for the start of this episode. What's up? 54 year old called it i knew he was guilty 54 years old sir i don't care if you're not the guy we are looking for we are looking for someone named 54 so you are clearly the culprit i'm gonna have to ask you to step out sir it's not necessary i'm not hiding anything oh that, that, that that's what someone hiding something would say look at that snake found it it's in the freaking roof man all right, my favorite part. I get to destroy things. Look at that. We got a whole crap load of smokes in here. Just falling on my head. Please take this money and let me pass. How much, man? How much? 340 again? I can't, man. I have to be a good cop for at least a little bit. You got anything in the engine? No, I think the rest of you is clean. Oh, no. I, Dude, last thing. I thought that was going to be it. That is commitment, putting it into a tire. I don't even know how you would do that, by the way. Okay, you are screwed, sir. You are under arrest. Your $340 isn't strong enough because I think I get paid $100 for you. Plus, I can probably sell the smokes for a profit. I forgot I had a guy in here. I'm sorry, but I don't really care. Uh, I shall transfer you sooner or later. <laughs> just realized this guy's got like three bottles of vodka just hidden down here. Oh, yeah, he is wasted right now. That's probably all for today. All right, so yeah, I guess we should uh, transfer the criminals over since we don't have a bit very big jail cell. Um, just so we don't waste time tomorrow. Uh, you're free to go? I can just tell them to go. Transfer to police car. Oh, great. Now I have to worry about gangs as well just throughout town. Oh, I have a feeling with that warning, we might actually be hit here. So good thing I bought a gun. It's actually... Oh, I can't keep that out when I'm driving. Oh, God, I knew it. What the hell? You don't even have a car. You're just shooting me. All right, well, that was the most anticlimactic fight ever. I just drove away. Maybe you should get a car if you're trying to, you know, save your friend. Shooting me as I go by isn't going to do much. All right, I got some fresh ones for the labor camp, my dude. Give me my damn money. 200 bucks. Not bad. I don't know if it was worth getting shot at, but hey, we have to deal with them somehow. Hi, criminals. Hi, criminals. Oh, 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 they they, they got me good that time. <laughs> Just camping out at the motel. <laughs> Jesus.
Oh, nothing like a peaceful day of getting shot at. Uh, life is good, man. All right, only two today. Um, still the 9.6 IU, so I guess... Oh, actually, the purple as well. So good to know it's not every day that these things change. So nothing new today we have to worry about. So should be pretty simple. Just got to keep an eye out for purple cars and a bad license plate. Oh, we got a bad passport already. Man, you guys just really got to work on your documentation. And everything's expired. He does have cargo and he's from Urkai. His entry is visit, but... I mean, is luggage considered cargo? Oh, that's the engine bay. That's cool. Uh, is there any illegal things in there? I think we're good. How the hell do I get... How do I grab this stuff? Sir, sorry. I'm gonna have to, uh, grab these, I think. Alright, so three things were bad. Um... Yeah, I don't know... Because he's only here for visiting. I don't know if the Urkai thing is actually right. But he does have luggage, so... Oh, I just approved him. What the hell did I just do? No, 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 no. Oh, you can't leave. Nope. This is my car now. How did I do? I just happily hit approve. Damn it. Well, there's my first screw up for the day. That's embarrassing. All right, what the hell do you got back here, sir? Oh, nothing. That's actually shocking, considering the style of this car. Hello. Yes, it's necessary for me to look at your documents. Oh, look, 96IU. I wonder if you're a criminal. You look like one, Jeffrey Dahmer. Even his name's wrong. Come on, man. Like, you, you, you don't think I'm going to look at your name? Well, there it is. Just gonna... <laughs> Dude's yelling at me. I can't... Okay, I have to use a knife. What the hell's the axe for? <laughs> there we go. What am I doing? Collecting drugs, of course. Come on, man. Oh, my knife actually broke. Oh, that's not good. I did not realize they break that quickly. Oh, I can't... Uh-oh. Um, Is there an extra knife here? I didn't realize my knife would break in two days. We're under attack. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Bigger problems! Who the is, is this the enemy? Okay, that's clue. Then I don't think it's the enemy. Okay, he, yeah, he's have his police thing on. Got him! One shot, one kill! Murderer! What the? He ran away! Oh my god! I just lost more money. Oh my god! Okay, I I I need to focus on the wilderness. Maybe that would be smart. I'm sorry for killing the guy. I thought he was the one that called these guys in. Dude, this is insane. There we go. Come on, kill him. And I'm out. Well, I guess we got to get the old pitchfork out. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, my God. Ah, die. Die, 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 die. Yep. Okay. Come back. And I'm almost dead, aren't I? Well, that guy just got hit. Oh, God. I just got hit. Okay. That guy's got a shotgun. This is not fun anymore. I found a cubby hole. I'm okay. There we go. I was totally helping. All right. Well, we're definitely going to have to go buy more... Uh, Ammo? And evidently, I'm going to need a knife as well. All right, so that was from Obernak Oberankov's gang. Uh, criminal group operating in Karikata. God, these names are so hard to say. <laughs> they are involved in smuggling arms and dealing with kidnapping for ransom. And also the blood fists were there as well, I guess. Okay, great. Can I loot their guns? Do they have any knives on them? I do need a knife today. I don't know where any of their bodies went. They must have cleaned them up. I love how this guy's just still waiting here. Like, yep, totally normal day at the border crossing, man. Just watched a shootout. Oh, God, I can't believe I lost 500 more dollars for murdering a guy. Come on. All right, I'm pretty sure this guy's good. I didn't really spend... Oh, my God, what is wrong with me? I am making a big mistake. Why do I keep doing that? What is wrong with my stupid brain? I'm going to earn no money in this damn game. I am so sorry. Oh, I did it two, two in a, two in a day, two in a day. I did wrong, but I knew it was right. I know he was clear. I'm dumb. I'm sorry. Oh God. Uh oh, oh, what is that? I thought that guy was coming here. Okay, I I need to go out. I need to buy a new knife or maybe two, and I should probably get some more ammo for my pistol. Hello, shady businessman. I'm here to buy your best bullets. All right, so $10 for pistol ammo. Yeah, we'll buy a few of those. I only bought one last time. That was a big mistake. Don't think we're going to get an upgraded gun anytime soon with how bad I am at this game. But uh, I need a knife. I need lots of knives. Commando knife, tactical knife. Do I, is it, does it matter? All right, I don't care about its, dur its uh, damage. I just care about how long it lasts. So we'll buy a couple of these, I guess. I don't know which ones are good. 55, 25. You know what? Let's just buy the cheap ones. All right, so yeah, things weren't as expensive as I thought, so that's not bad. I still have a decent amount of money, I guess, but... Man, I'd be sitting at like a thousand if I didn't screw up simple things. 
Uh, isn't it great when you earn negative 506 in a day? I mean, $500 for a murder, was it worth it? I would have almost broke even if I didn't murder a guy. <laughs> of course, that's the one time I had good aim, by the way. One shot, one kill, lose $500. Okay, I cannot screw up today. I cannot screw up. There's nothing new I have to worry about. If I screw up today, I don't deserve this freaking job. Documentation. I think we got some cargo here, don't we? We have cows? Exciting. Hello, Moo Moo's. Wait, two. Two. Two? My family's in danger. I have to take this course to pay off my debt. Please let me in. Why are you bringing a cow then? Just be careful with it. Oh, trust me, I'll be careful with the cow. I just thought I'd count it just in case. Yeah, dude, why did you say you have two cows when you have one? Cargo list is wrong. Let's check your ID and whatnot now. I feel so bad for this guy. The only thing that's wrong is the, 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 the cargo list. And he's just trying to help his family or something, but that's probably uh, a, a lie. You just would have said you had one cow, you would have been good, but I have to deny you, sir. Inspection's finished. That's not two cows, it's one. Denied. What a day. I feel bad. Oh my god, I feel really bad about this one. There's really nothing wrong besides the one cow. Uh, you might want to close the back gate. I, I hope Betsy doesn't move around much. That would really ruin his day. Dude, this thing is dope. Justified. I've been promoted? Yay! I've been promoted, sir! Are you not excited for me? Alright, thank you. Let's just grab this. I don't even know what that means. Uh, from now on, you can call Vlad to come with his tools. Ah! Oh, that's fantastic. I don't like driving around this game. I get shot at too much. Alright, this guy's got a refrigerator. Checks out, man. Checks out. I, I do want to unpack that just to open it up, just to make sure there's no drugs in here. Alright, you're, you're, you're good. Oh, come on, man. I feel so bad. Everyone's just... Just update your documents, please! Everything would have been good if you just didn't have an invalid document, man. I have to earn money, so I have to deny you. <laughs> Why? Documentation expired. God, this this job would get so old with people getting mad at you. Car's got more rust than anything else. Jesus, man. What the hell do you got in the back there? Oh, he did... Okay, so he has luggage and soap again. Um, all right, you're from the same nation, so everything is good there. That's odd. Dude just packs two of the same luggages. Okay, everything looks good in there. All right, finally someone who's good, I think. Hope I'm not wrong on that, but it's nice to let someone in for once. Jesus. Now, I have seen there's an exclamation mark over here, so I'm just going to check what this is, as we have some free time. Work phone. From now on, you can order Vlad's mo uh, mobile shop. Shop will be available at the end of the current business day. That is actually amazing. Okay. So that's what that was about. Look at that. Today is going well. Is that everybody? <gasps> I did a perfect day. Yay. I love how this outhouse has a heart on it. Can I <laughs> can actually sit in here? Oh, look at that. More KGB B KGP files. Okay, that feels good, though. We are back in business. Uh, we earned $470. Not bad. Turn to the border post office to receive new orders. Uh-oh. Why am I up early in the morning, I'm assuming? Hello? Oh, is that Vlad's store? Can I get him to come here with Vlad with his new thing? All right, so we have to go uh, stake out some guy now. That's going to be exciting. I was going to say, it might not be a good idea to go in a police uh, van, but it looks like I got a new car now. Look at this thing. I don't know where this came from, but I will gladly use this. How do I turn it on? Start engine. There we go. And lights. Okay. Follow this guy. Do I turn off my lights? Is, is that cautious or just uh, suspicious? Just a car driving without lights might be weird. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna follow this guy. Hopefully he doesn't come this way or that's gonna be awkward. There he goes. All right, let's follow. This is exciting. I feel weird playing a simulation game with like an actual decent storyline in it. Like usually these games are just about earning money and getting upgrades. This is kind of nice that they actually figured out a plot for this and uh, I'm kind of invested into it. So hopefully we can get some intel with this gang here. Target's too far, what the frick are you talking about? He's right, oh, there he is. How is he too far? What do you mean he's too far? Where the hell is he going? All right, hold on. Let's, I, guess, I guess we'll get out too. Never mind. Cutscene. Game lost. What the hell are you talking about? He was right in front of me a second ago. Shut up. Oh, God damn it, man. I'm mad now. Oh, just spawns me out of the car now. Is he there? Oh, he's right there. Okay. What you doing, big guy? 
Going down a creepy walkway. Just gonna follow you. Can I just backtrack now? I mean, it's clear we know where he's going. Please don't turn around. Please don't turn around. Oh, God. Oh, God. Ugh. See, I'm too far away. That's the problem. All right, stick to the woods. Stick to the woods. Target is not too far away. He's right in front of me, gang. Oh, God. You're so frustrating. <gasps> I swear to God, if he turns around right now, he's dropped this thing. He's going in. I did it. Stealth mission complete. It only took me like three times. Too far away. Dude, I know where he is. He's in the freaking house. Am I supposed to go in there? Okay, I guess I'm going in there. Hello. You've led me to the dragon's den. You just let me in? Okay. What's up, man? I know you've been here for a short time. You don't know the whole truth. This tyrant Akarov gets rid of everyone who strives for freedom and democracy. Opposition leader Michael Guerin barely survived after how they tried to poison him. The Blood Fist group he established will do anything to stop this criminal deal. You can continue to obey the communist orders or join us and save this poor country. Ah, the pivot decision. Oh, this is actually hard because I definitely don't trust the government. I feel like they're shady. I don't know much about this guy, though. Oh, I think I'm going to release him. I'm doing it. That was a big decision. Being aware of the consequences of the traitors, you decide to help him escape. After an hour of driving through the wasteland, you arrive at an abandoned mine whose tunnels lead far beyond the border of Akaristan. A Akaristan? I can't say that. The commissioner is furious about the defeat, which you explain by the breakdown of the police car. Ah, uh, well, I guess we joined the Blood Fist. Well, not technically joined, but we did help that guy escape. Don't know if I'm going to regret that decision or not, but, uh, I mean, it's hard to trust anyone in this game. Let's be honest here. I keep getting shot at. I hardly get any pay doing this damn job. And I, I, I guess I do have $1,000 in the bank, which is pretty good for the 80s. All right, guys, but I think that's a good time to wrap up this episode here. The plot thickens. Hopefully in the next episode, we can get a few upgrades here and, uh, well, get paid more because we're going to need lots of guns because I feel like we're going to get some enemies in this game in the very near future. I mean, hell, we already have enemies in this game. As always, guys, thanks for watching and liking, and I'll see you in the next one.